Hello everyone, Gadget Girl Kylie here and welcome back to another Let's Play walkthrough episode of my Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth Hacker's Memory series. So we are making our way to Kowloon level 2, so we've got to first get through level 1. So I'm trying to still decide the format of this series guys and in my previous Cyber Sleuth Let's Play of the Japanese version of the first game and the English playthrough that I did. I actually cut out some of the grind in the game, so I did a lot of off-camera leveling up, training of Digimon, Digivolving, D-Digivolving, and, you know, the kind of monotonous stuff in the game. So I'm kind of thinking I'm probably going to do that for this series as well. I'm not going to include loads of grinds. I might include a little bit, and I definitely think I'm going to include some fights getting from point A to point B, because otherwise it's boring for you guys. But uh, yeah, I'm probably not going to do loads of on-screen training though, now that this is a pre-record series. But anyways, now that I've updated you guys on that, let's check out the Digiline. Maybe I'll become a computer whiz if a hacker can teach me. You're one, right? I've already replied to that, haven't I? I'm sure I have. That rings a bell. Alright, Pabumon in the farm is at max level. Okay. And that's it. I might be thinking I've already replied to it because I do have a confession to make, guys. I actually already recorded this episode, but OBS decided it was going to crap out on me, freeze, and I lost all of the footage. So it was a good thing that I hadn't saved my game yet, so this is why I'm redoing, re-recording this episode. <laughs> so a little bit annoying, guys. But yeah, OBS is a little bit temperamental because... What I've got is I've got hotkeys to start and stop recording and I've noticed that sometimes when I hotkey to stop recording it just freezes and OBS just goes bleh, <laughs> no. <laughs> so it just completely crashes on me. So now instead what I'm going to do is just manually uh, press stop recording instead and it seems to be working now. I've tried it a few times before recording this episode so fingers crossed this one works. Anyway, hacking skill wall crack. You can eliminate secure firewalls that block your way and continue your progress. This skill has different levels depending on the resilience of the firewall and you won't be able to take down a firewall if your wall crack skill isn't high enough. So this is obviously level 1 because it has level 1 on it, so let's go. And I do think this feature in the game is really really cool where you get to fight some of the walls. Uh, it makes me feel like a proper hacker actually. <laughs> it's really really awesome. Right, that's better. Now we're zoomed out, we can actually see the shinies. Okay. So we can't even go that way anyway because there's a guy blocking the way, which means in Cyber Sleuth that you need to progress a little bit more before that person shifts their arse. Shift your arse, fool! Okay, I'm sorry, Saw's hard. Right, there's a shiny over there, I see it. I'm still trying to figure out what Digimon I want to get in my team. I'll have to go on Google and see if there's a list of all the Digimon in this game. Because apparently, according to a viewer at the live streams of the first few episodes, they said that they've added like a hundred or more new Digimon in this game. So I don't want a team that's completely the same as my original Cyber Sleuth Let's Play, but I would still like Magnadramon in my team because it is my all-time favourite Digimon to be honest. But uh, other than that, I think I should probably try and change my team. So. Don't expect the Digimon in my team at the moment to stay, basically, is what I'm saying. Uh, for now, I'm just happy to get some Digimon as soon as I can, but I'm still trying to figure out who I want to go with in the long run. Yeah, I'm a little OCD when it comes to balance with my Digimon, as some of you may have noticed from my first Cyber Sleuth Let's Play. <laughs> 
So I like to have balance in type and balance in elements as well, pretty much. So I'm just going to select auto for now because these early fights in the game are always easy. Oh, I also remembered to put Peter, my Patamon, in the background this time. <laughs> I have to switch my plushies round depending on the game I'm playing. Yes, like Dot. I absolutely despise Dot. Worst status ailment in this game ever. Hate, hate, hate it. Oh, there's one of those little machine things. I should totally try and revive that. Because I've got stronger Digimon now, so I should be able to do it. Fingers crossed. Right, I'll go for this box first. HP capsule. I mean, this is something else I want to point out as well. In my original Side of Sleep Let's Play, I didn't bother equipping any of the, you know, boost items to my Digimon, like uh, boost HP, boost attack and stuff like that. I didn't do it till like much later on into the game because I kept switching my team around and if I equipped anything to my Digimon, I'd forget it's there. I am so forgetful. And then I'd be like, where's that item again? Who is it equipped to? <laughs> So that's why I don't equip stuff early on until I'm kind of like happy with the way my team is going. Debug log error 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 item output beep boop. Happy hacker memory. Yeah, we got a new memory guys. Awesome. We'll have to remember <laughs> to check that out later. My memory is awful. Ah! He's turning Super Saiyan! His power's over 9,000! sure that I had um, that Digimon who's on my team that isn't mine. I think I ended up with that one on my team in my original playthrough as well in the end. Nice. Getting close to 200% scan with that one. Oh damn it, I skipped that text there. Oh well. <laughs> Basically, get out of here, blah blah blah. Fight me. <laughs> Fight me! I'm just gonna go on auto because honestly, these fights are just piss easy at the moment. When we come to a boss fight, I will manually control my Digimon though. I will say that one of the downsides of doing auto is that they do tend to use their special abilities that cost SP more than simply attacking regularly. So if you do want to conserve SP, I recommend just still doing manual. But if you're not bothered, it's fine. We know this guy! We know this guy! This is an early quest uh, character from the original Cyber Sleuth game. Mephisto! That is such a villain's name. I do love this mask though. It's very Renaissance, isn't it? I think we're here to punish you. It's clobbering time! 
Get ready to feel the pain, Mephisto! Oh, I'm sorry that we've inconvenienced you. Like we're just gonna let him stroll away. アカウントバイバイは実に割りないいしもと。赤たちは小遣い程度の額で節々とアカウントを集めてきてくれるし、それを高値で買う人間は困っている。一斉にもならない正義の味方ごっこで。We're not giving you a choice! <laughs> well, since you've said that, feel free to leave! <laughs> this guy is like totally up himself. I'm too important to deal with you! Underestimate us and you will regret it more like. Don't get too cocky, Mephisto. Okay, I'm definitely gonna manually control here. Only 29, but it was a crit though. <laughs> okay, let's try a Holy Light level 2 um, because Gatamon is super effective. So I just want to see what's the best choice for me to be doing in this fight. Damage wise. Oh, 451. Okay, never mind. Definitely that move. <laughs> Just saying. Desolation Claw. Nice victory. That was easy. Didn't even break a sweat. Oh yes, we got memory up. That means we can digivolve and get more Digimon in the team, guys. Or stronger Digimon in the team, at the very least. New Digimon hype! Give the video a like! I almost said stream there. <laughs> no, Kylie, this is pre-record now. I'm so used to being a streamer that I just automatically say give the stream a like. <laughs> I should just say give the video a like and get used to saying that and then it doesn't matter whether it's a stream or a pre-record. It's the same thing. Okay, step back! <laughs> Well, his Digimon flashed up behind him there briefly. I can barely... I just remember this character from the original Cyber Sleuth, but I don't remember the quest at all. <laughs> okay, he just teleported, apparently. Come back here, you fiends! Shirabata Oh, so it's not over. 
It's not over, guys. We gotta get the rest of the accounts. Yay! Erika Waifu! It's been a while! Erika! <laughs> Ooh, Digiline! Let's have a look. Some old guy grabbed me outside K Cafe, wanted to buy Digimon medals. Oh yes, him! I remember him. There are some weirdos. You might make some spare change if someone buys it at a good price. That's the reply I want. Hee hee hee. Right, item, you're mine in a second. When I get there, wait for me! <laughs> if we see an access point, guys, we'll quickly nip back and see what Digimon we can digivolve, etc. I will try and go for different Digimon. <laughs> I can't help it. I'm drawn to ones that I know. <laughs> nice Beomon there. Beomon! So what's everybody's favourite Digimon? Leave comments down below, let me know. As I say, mine is Magnadramon. I keep repeating it because so many people ask me what my favourite Digimon is. <laughs> I think I probably get that question on every single episode. Uh, or at least I did, like, almost every single episode of my original Cyber Sleuth Let's Play. So if I repeat it a lot, it's because I get asked it a lot, guys. <laughs> To be fair, that's because some people come for specific videos to get tips and stuff as well. I keep accidentally pressing X to skip. I so want that Digimon on the left. So, so badly. So I'm going to try and aim for that. That's going to be a Digimon in my team, actually. Definitely. I mean, it's a freaking dragon. Come on now. Seriously. Can I get a full team of dragon Digimon? Are there enough dragon Digimon in the game to do that? I don't know. <laughs> I'd be very happy if I could just have a full team of dragon Digimon. But they have to be all different elements though for it to work. And types as well. Because I want that balance. Fight me, brah! Oh, Agamon and Black Agamon, cool. Attack down. Sweet! Murray told me to talk to you more, so I'm gonna do just that. Talk to you soon. So I'm talking you I'm talking to you to tell you that I'm talking to you to talk to you more. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I might not always be able to reply, but you can contact me anytime. That pretty much summarizes the YouTube comment section, really. I mean, I try my best to reply to as many comments as possible. I feel like I'm very active in my comment section, especially compared to other content creators anyway. But it's impossible to reply to every single comment, guys. So I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm not ignoring you. I do read every single comment, but I can't reply to all of them because I wouldn't make any content if I did. <laughs> Lilla 
Digifarm medal! Treadmill! Ooh, the treadmill is a training item for the Digifarm. Form 1 training command completed. Please give a command to your Digifarm. Okay. Definitely if we see an access point. But I don't think there is one in this area. I think it's pretty much going straight to a boss fight in a moment. Yo, come on at 100%. Nice. And I'm going to start digi converting loads of Digimon just so I can take them down different digi evolution paths. Which is the best thing to do, really, in the game, to be honest, guys. Just digi convert as much as you can and just go down so many different paths to open up new possibilities of Digimon digi evolution. Oh, come on! He just trolled me there! He was like, you need to heal. Well, heal me then, brah. Heal me. Then just talk about healing and then don't heal me. That's trollish. Oh my god, Digiline, man. Seriously. They'll pay big for rare medals. Easy money, right? I don't think I collected all the medals in my original Cyber Sleuth Let's Play, to be honest. There's that Dragon Digimon again! Stop teasing me, game. Stop it. I want it now. 976 damage. Damn! This is why Gatamon is so OP early on. Just deals crazy amounts of damage. Oh, nice. Every single one of my Digimon was super effective against every single one of his Digimon. That worked out well, didn't it? Oh, nice. We got an Agumon medal as well. Right, before I forget, I'm actually going to just use that memory up now. 20 to 25. Nice. So, Alekmon should be able to Digivolve, and we should have enough space to keep it in the team. At its next stage as well. Oh, the pro tag! The pro tag of the previous game. See, I called it. Hashtag she called it. I did say that it would be the male version. The female version wears different clothes. So that is the male pro tag. Which is kind of weird for me since I played through the original game as a female. But there we go. I did say that they would default it as male. So yeah, it's definitely the same character, we're just catching the end of that mission from the previous Cyber Sleuth game. And we're probably never going to get to see the face either, it's probably just always going to be cut off here because it's kind of like, you can tell it's the male character from the clothes, but they probably want to keep it slightly ambiguous uh, by not showing you the face, just chopping it off around the shoulders. Yeah, there we go. しっかりしてくださいよ、メフィストさんさん。縮小。こんな激走としまって。おい。あ、なんだてめえら。お前たちと同業の<笑> メフィストさんさんはいつも通り<笑> Well, we saw a glimpse of that, the Digimon appearing behind him when he had that weird purple aura. Oh, 
一体どうしまったんだろうなメフィストさんはさあな突然人が変わったように暴れ始めた一瞬奴の背後にデジモンのような姿が見えたひょっとしたらそのせいで奴はおかしくなったのかもしれないな俺たちのデータ化された意識にデジモンが干渉しないとは言い切れないということだうーん、ビーマインドコントロールドバイデジモンうぅあつくれぃぺぃまあ、噛み砕いて説明するとだなエデンの根幹システムには精神のデータ化ってのがあるだろう俺たちの意識はエデンにログインする際にスキャニングされてああ、oh, I don't know if I like that Our minds are scanned when we log into Eden and uploaded to the virtual space as mind data Don't know about you guys but I don't think I like the idea of my mind being scanned エデンアバターにそのデータがダウンロードされることで俺たちは現実世界の記憶を引き継いで仮想空間で活動ができるようになるってわけだ精神データはあくまでデータだからデジモンプログラムの影響を受けることもあるんじゃねえのってことさ That is true でもそんなことはありえないと思う精神データを守っている防壁は何よりも強固なはずだし I mean, since it's data, is it really your mind or is it a copy of your mind? I'm not sure about the semantics of that. I mean, it's られたアカウントデータの破棄だ奪われたアカウントは全て取り返す必要があるメフィストさんの端末情報はコピーしてもエリカ解析してくれ奴が他のアカウントをどこにやったのか知りたいうんワームは手伝ってイエーイワーマンおお前お手伝いができるようになったのかウェンモン isn't useless! <laughs> Erica saved me, so I'm now her slave! This is how I pay for my keep! <laughs> Basically, Erica has enslaved w o r m o n right now. <laughs> That's the way I see it, anyway. そいつだな。なんて企業だ。名前は。ユミバンキング。オッケー。it's so delicious。and nutritious。どう考えてもいや。そのまんま過ぎて。悪ふざけのレベルだね。メフィートさんは。この企業に。アカウントを売っていたみたい。おお、that's the guy。Yes. アカウントの転送先はその企業サーバーか。直接侵入してデータを奪うぞ。ほんじゃま、俺とお嬢は引き続きサポートに回りますか。ふ、hmm. ん。Isn't it interesting how everything's lining up here? どうした行くぞ。OK、so let me go ahead and check out my Digimon, see which ones I can Digivolve, etc. Right, Digivolve time! Luckmon! Ooh, I don't know which route to go, I really don't. See, that's Garurumon and that's Garurumon as well. So, attack 55, maybe wait to go down this route. What's the attack on? 53, so not long, really.、Um, hang on a second.
Might just wait then. Wait until it gets um, 55 attack and take it down this route. I don't know what the true route is for this Digimon. I'm guessing it's the second one. It's not Garurumon, is it? So... Right. Ooh! Okay, um... Don't know what that one is, don't know what that one is either. Oh, cam 10%. Oh, hang on. Cam 10%. Right. Um, we can do that. We can do that right now. Right, 8%. 9. Ten. There we go. We can digivolve now. Yay! Dracomon! Dracomon hype! Oh, so cute! Monty Mon. Let's go down this route. Fan B Mon. Oh, that's quite cute. I'm not normally a lover of bug type um, Pokemon, Digimon, monsters. You know, I'm just not, but I actually like the look of that. It's quite cute. I don't know. I think I'll just go for this one. Oh god, that is hideous! What have I done? <laughs> what is that? That is absolutely disgusting! But at the same time, it's kind of derp and cute, weirdly. Its eyes are moving around in its head. Ah, very, very weird. I don't think any of you viewers will want to have you names, uh, you know, have your name on this Digimon, quite frankly. <laughs> but I could be wrong, I could be wrong, someone might say, pick me, pick me, take one for the team. Right, I have no idea what the true route is, I'm guessing it's that top one. Level 14. But then there's also the second one as well, which I can't tell what that is. So everybody has Digivolve for now. Let me just go over to Digiconvert and see. Yep, we've got a 200% scan, so let's do that. And let's check out the path it can go down so I'll probably go for one of these two I recognize the silhouettes but I can't think of their names off the top of my head to be honest right okay so let me go over to Lekmon so I'm probably gonna wait until it's got 55 attack to digivolve it down this path so I'm gonna move it out of my team for now And let's just switch back in Raidomo, which is already named, by the way, obviously. Because um, that needs to be level 30 to Digivolve, so that's fine. So I'll wait for that. And then that keeps the team balanced. So we've got... I could passively train up another Digimon at the same time. Which would mean it levels up more quickly. Um, so yeah, I'll put that in my team for now. I'm not going to name it though. 
because obviously it's just training passively at the moment. So yeah, that, that'll do guys, that'll do. I'm happy with that. I'm not going to name Digimon after viewers until I put them in my team really because otherwise there's no point to be honest. Um, but yeah, that'll do for now guys. So I'm going to go ahead and stop this episode here. Don't forget to like, comment, favourite, share and of course subscribe. Join Team GGK for more Digimon goodness and obviously I am a streamer as well so if you want to jump in the live streams make sure you sub and turn on notifications. But anyways thank you so much for watching, take it easy and I shall see you next time guys. Bye bye!